ExpressLyArkinkins.com on our way home from Jiu-Jitsu because I do Jiu-Jitsu every once a week or so, which is probably three, three times a week. Okay. Oh, um, I have something to tell Pino Chichi, but I'll wait for that after the vlog. Um, so I have, um, um, that there, I've learned sh the Captain Hook Escape, the Arm Drag, and, and, um, Quick Feet, which are the techniques I learned today. And I'm going to have my birthday party at the dojo because, because I really like going to the like, dojo slash academy. I don't know what I'm trying to say. Um, it's actually, it's quite, um, fun there. And if you're in my area around Greenwood Village, I would recommend going to it. What's it called? It's called D D D Mile High Jiu Jitsu Academy. <laughs> no. I don't know the name. <laughs> um, who, who is the. Uh, House and Gracie something Jiu Jitsu Academy. Yeah. Wait, it doesn't specify where it is. In House and Gracie, Colorado. House and Gracie, Colorado. Yeah. Okay. So that's the Jiu Jitsu thing. And have you ever met, met House and Gracie? Yes. You want no. to talk about that? Yeah, um, I've met Halston Gracie twice. Well, I've seen Halston Gracie twice. And I've still three times? No, not three times yet. Remember, I've only been going for, um, this is my second year. I see him every year. Okay, you see him twice a year, should be. Oh, yeah. Uh, maybe I've seen him three times. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know how many times I've seen him. But I've met Halston Gracie, he who is, who is the son of the person. Helio. Helio. The son of Helio, who, inven who invented, um, who invented Brazilian Jiu Jitsu, which is what I do, and. Uh, well, no, it's what I'm going to say. You've been going for two years? I've been going for two years. Almost I have a, two years. Almost two years. I have a yellow belt in Jiu Jitsu, mm -hmm. and um, we're going to be missing promotions, so I'm not going to be going at, um, to ju uh, Jiu Jitsu every three days when I'm on vacation because we'll miss Saturday. Um, this Friday, I'm leaving for a Camelot Camp vacation, and it'll be a very exciting vlog. Well, what's going to happen on Camelot Camp? Ooh, I can't exactly explain all of it, but we, me and my mom, are in charge of the vegetables bringing. The vegetable bringing. So, um, magical go home in three... Everyone, I'm back. Actually, I'm not in the house. I'm on the radio house, too. I'm... I have my, to say my opinion on line arts. So, if you're good at drawing, please don't use line art. If you're bad at drawing, please go ahead and use dry, line art as long not dry art, line art as long as you're act as it's in a style that you don't really know how to use. You can use it if you're a pro in a style that you don't really know how to use. You can use line art for that until you get the hang of drawing it, and. For, and then for things like that, if you actually draw yourself, your a line art like that you made yourself for yourself, or for some for other people to use, it's fine if you use it. It's your peer drawing. If you're a pro, if you're a pro, then please use that as much as you as much as you'd like. So, so this is kind of my little opinion on using line art, pro or not good, pro or noob. I'm just gonna say. Can you uh, explain what you mean by line art, please? Line art. It's lines that you made that you co by someone else that you color in or by yourself, so that you color in to make it your character. So you download something that someone else drew and yep. you just color it. Yes. Okay. They're also called bases if they already have. They're called bases if they're already co are already col colored a little bit, like if they have the skin colored mm -hmm. and the hair's not drawn or anything. If they just have a skin like a skin angry anime person or something, then you can. Then you can. Then that's a base, and you use it, and you use it like that. And uh, do you have the same opinion about bases that you do about line art? Pretty much bases, but if you have to be. But you, can, if you're an exception, you can use bases as line, if you're not good at uh, drawing skin, but you're good at draw, but you're good at drawing the actual thing. And one thing for you all: don't be an art thief. If you're an art thief. I immediately dislike you. I will unfriend you on everything, no matter what. I immediately don't like you at all. Hey, what, you, do you, what do you mean by art thief? Taking someone's art and claiming it to be your own. Oh, okay. 
like copying someone's art, maybe slightly editing it, and then claiming the whole thing to be your own. Like, you have this this girl that has black hair and that has black hair, just straight black hair, and she and she's wearing a white dress. You change her her dress to black with red spots and make a red streak in her hair, and then you claim the whole thing to be your own. It's not. It's to say credit to whoever made it for part of it for the original thing. So. So if you edit something, please do not claim the whole thing to be your own. That's an art thief, and I immediately dislike you if you're an art thief. Bye!